Modeling with Algebra. I am Anil Kumar and in this video we will understand how to write a statement in the form of algebraic equation. Question here is define variables and then write an equation to represent each description. So we have four statements here. You can pause the video, copy these statements, write down your equations and then check with my solution. Okay, is 3 more than 5 times the number is 43. B is product of 3 consecutive numbers is 120. 7 less than the number is 27. And the last one is 2 third of a number is 32. So you can pause and write on the equations and then check with my solution. Now in all these four statements what we observe is that our variable should be defining a number. We have 3 more than 5 times the number is 43. So in general, let me define the number itself. Let's say let the number be n. So n is the number for all these four statements, right? So that is how we define a variable. So that could be any number, right? That's what it means. 3 more than 5 times the number is 43. So that means 3 more than 5 times. So what is 5 times the number? 5n. 5n is 5 times the number. 3 more than, that means plus 3, is means equal to 43. So that is how you translate a statement into equation, correct? 3 more than 5 times the number is 43. My recommendation is not to write 3 plus 5n, but to write 5n plus 3 equals to 43. Whenever you read this than, then the number comes first, right? 3 more than 5 times, so 5 times n should come first. Take care, since that can sometimes lead to error. Now. The second statement is product of three consecutive numbers is 120. Now consecutive numbers are what? These are the numbers which come together. If n is one number, then what is the next number? If n is one number, next number will be n plus one. Do you understand? Like three, four, five, the numbers which come together. Product of three consecutive numbers. So we need three numbers n, n plus 1, next will be n plus 2, correct? Product of 3 consecutive numbers means multiply them, is equal to 120. So that is how you can form an equation from the given statement, correct? 7 less than the number is 27. So we should write what number first, number minus 7 is means equal to 27. That is the correct statement. If you write 7 first, you will get incorrect answer. D is 2 third of a number is 32. 2 third is a fraction, 2 over 3. 2 third of a number means of means times. Times number is, is equal to 32. So that is the equation which represents the statement 2 third of a number is 32. Okay, go through these examples and understand the strategy. I hope that will help you. Thank you and all the best.